So I use Camtasia Studio to record my audio. I know it's kind of silly, but just hear me out here. And uh, I opened up Camtasia Studio today to record a little narration for this uh, video project I threw together in Sony Vegas. And the l it was still on full screen. So I checked the last time I even opened Camtasia, which means the last time I even recorded audio, was June 8th. 2018, which is the cup final game five, which I recorded full screen. So yeah, I haven't recorded audio in over a month, let alone a video to actually upload. My point is, hello, uh, I work a lot and I have a lot of social things going on, which is a change. I promised myself that I would only do one take. I've been guilty in the past. I used to be really bad at it when I was depressed in like 2014. If you go back and listen to 2013 as well, if you go back and listen to some of those Pokemon Showdown post um, there's like 40 audio cuts in it. I would record like 10 seconds of audio and then be upset or like stumble over a word or something. Or like be upset, I mean like be upset with what I said or something. I don't know. It was never up to my standard. So I would, I would just splice together this like ugly looking thing on the timeline. And uh, um, I got out of that habit, and the last two Splatoon Saturdays have been like spliced together like that, where I'll like say something and I don't like it, so I like I ended up editing together like 15 pieces of audio and track narration, and I'm like, nope, none of that. I promised myself that I'm gonna come on today and speak to you guys for eight minutes, and it's already been a minute and a half, so um, I should probably spit out my ideas. I have quite a bit to talk about. And, uh, the, what you're seeing in the background is. Uh, Turf War from the last Splatfest we had, uh, I think I was at like 2200 rank for both of these, so, I mean, quote unquote, very competitive, high level Turf War, um, which as you can see in the second game, the Shifty Station map was really interesting because if you sprayed at the floor, uh, you could splash your ink underneath the other t other wall, like, y y you'll see it at the start of the second game, if you shoot right at the ground, it splashes under the wall onto the other team's side, and I spent like a minute fucking around doing that, which really proves that Turf War is irrelevant and really stupid, you can do whatever you want, you might still win or you might still lose, it's just, just a big shit show. Um, anyway, yeah, I, I, I've, I have so much stuff on my desktop that I've been wanting to upload the last, like, a month, I had... I had kind of like a joke, I know Chum Chow did it like the road to 10,000 where he uploaded like one video and it was like five minutes long and it was his last race. He started at like 99.80 and he's like, there we go, I hope you enjoyed my road to 10,000. And I was going to do a road to S rank where I started at A plus in a little bit and I recorded one for Rainmaker because it was my favorite mode and it was the first mode I got to S in and I didn't play great. It was on Schellendorf and Camp Triggerfish, I think. So like it was my favorite map, two maps. For Rainmaker. Uh, yeah, I love Prana Pit, but those are probably my two favorite maps, other than Prana Pit. Uh, regardless, uh, the recording didn't turn out well. I've had the audio sitting on my desktop for like two months, and I just decided to say today, fuck it, I deleted it. Like the final game where I got to S, plus, or hello? The final game where I actually got to S from A, plus was uh, a disconnect on the other team, so he won four on three. Not that interesting. I also played terribly in it. So I decided to redo the series with tower control. I'm like, okay, that was terrible, but I can upload like a tower control at Road to S. That'd be funny. Still terrible. I did that as well, and I started at like A plus in a bit, and it, that recording turned out bad too. So I just decided, you know what? No jokes for me. The Road to S thing is stupid. I'm just, I just deleted everything. So I think I'm rank S right now on everything, and I'm S plus in Rainmaker, actually. So your boy has come a long way, even though... S plus isn't that impressive, it still proves that you can at least pick up a weapon and contribute to a team, and that weapon for me is the one that you can see me using, and it is the Splattershot Pro. I fucking love Point Sensor, and Rain, but Point Sensor especially, it's so useful. You're in trouble, you're about to die, throw it on a Point Sensor, and for the next 15 seconds, because nobody runs cold-blooded, and you have a shit ton of sub power up, they're, they're alerted to your entire team. Oh, brilliant. Love it. Anyway, this is what I was talking about, but shooting under the wall is really stupid. So, um, other than that, yeah, I, I, I went through, I deleted a bunch. I might, maybe, maybe might still play Plants vs. Zombies. I have the thumbnail already made, and it's been sitting there for like four months on my desktop. And I do enjoy some of the puzzle modes, so maybe I'll throw together like an hour video and use up the... Uh, may, maybe. Past that, uh, yeah, I deleted a bunch of other stuff. There's like a few videos that have been in my, my Mario Kart 8 folder for like a year and a half. Just stupid little clips that are like 20 seconds, maybe 30 seconds, and I might just do it all. I might just title a video sometime soon. Um, 
remainder ran like the remainder of the random little clips I have on my hard drive that I might as well not delete. I might as well upload them because they're at least worth putting words over. Who knows? Um, if you can't tell, <laughs> I'm I'm about done to hang. I'm I'm about ready to hang it up. Uh, things have just gotten too busy. Uh, during the summer, I'm working every morning at six o'clock, so I have to be up at five thirty. That means no more late nights. I'm normally in bed by about nine, ten, asleep kind of thing. Um, yeah, and just like at work, there's a bunch of great guys that I work with, and we're we're hanging out all the time. And there's like four girls that I'm really close with now, and we're all talking and like going out clubbing on this night, and then like going over to Buddy's house on another night, and it's like I'm meeting up with some other people. This is my last summer in Southern Ontario. I've lived here 23 years, and I'm going to school in September up in Northern Ontario. And if you don't know how big Ontario is, that's a big fucking difference. That's 16 hours, and I'm still in the same province. So, I have a bunch of people that I want to hang out with a lot. Um, when I'm not working, which I'm mean, I get off work at 2 o'clock, so I get home my shower, it's like 3 o'clock. So I have every evening to myself, and most nights I'm out, I'm either going for a walk with my mom, or like helping with dinner or something, and then, or like going out and clubbing, or like, I don't know, just having fun, right? It's my, my last... So there's a ton of things that I want to do and people to hang out with and things to see uh, past making YouTube videos. So I still play Splatoon occasionally? But honestly, it's the only game I'm playing right now. I, did, I didn't buy Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze, even though I really wanted to, because I knew I'd never get to play it. Why Why spend 90 bucks on a game if you know you're probably not going to get the chance to enjoy it? So, it's definitely at the top of my list, but like, I still haven't played Fallout 4, I haven't played, uh, the... It's on my desktop. It literally has an icon on my desktop. It is called, uh, What Remains of Edith Finch. It's supposed to be like a two hour long game that's just heavy story, and I still haven't even played it. And I'm like, excited to... Uh, whatever. Got 17 seconds here, let's make it count, kid. Um, I feel great. I know I used to use these a lot for like updates and vlogs and shit like how I'm feeling and how I'm doing. Um, I honestly haven't been more confident or happy with how I look and how I feel in like three years. I, I feel, I feel great. Look good, feel good. And, uh, the Accutane that I think I was mentioning, maybe in a video, to try to cure my acne, fucking did the trick. I haven't been able to drink in six months, and let me tell you, when your hockey team makes the playoffs and gets to the semifinals, that's tough! All I wanted to do was pound back some beers and watch my boys play hockey. But, I I mean, the, the, the choices are, take Accutane and get rid of your acne, and if you drink, you die. So, it was a pretty easy choice, get rid of my acne and don't die. And yeah, seriously, it, it's completely gone, my face looks great, and uh, I mean, that in, that in itself gives you a lot of confidence, right? Because you just look good, you feel good, people aren't judging you right away. And it's a shitty thing to say, but it's, it's how it's how the world works. Anyway, I have about 30 seconds here, so I just want to thank you all for watching, for listening. Uh, this is not going to be my last video. I have a couple... I have one Splatoon video that's going to take like a couple hours of work, and that's going to be like my last real big editing project here probably on my channel ever. I have a couple more weekly things I want to do. I'm definitely going to do another episode of Mario Kart before I call it quits, and... Uh, I don't know, I'm going to buy Smash Brothers when it comes out, but I might not be making any videos then because I'm going to be up at school. Until then, that's a lot of future stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching this one. Uh, I love you all. Thank you always for tuning in, and I'll see you when I see you. One take, baby.